brings you a matchup of division rivals. It's the San Francisco Giants and the San Diego Padres. First pitch coming your way next. Just about set to go now. And towing the slab, James Caprillion. And Singy, it's unique these days, but he's more of a pitch-to-contact type of guy. Yeah, Boogie, he doesn't rely too heavily on the strikeout. He knows he needs to miss barrels, get some soft contact, let the defense do work behind him. And I think a guy like that can keep a good tempo, don't give hitters time to adjust or think. They can move through a ball game, and you look up, they're in line for a quality start. We'll see what he's got in this one. Emmanuel Paquez, the next to hit, takes ball one. Backdoor breaking ball just missed right there, and boy, umpire didn't give him the call. I bet you if he throws it again, hitter knows he's going to have to swing it. And this ball's going to wind up out of play. So a big-time costly mistake there. Well, that's just a killer for the defense. They get the ground ball they were looking for. Should be out of the inning and out of the jam, but he launched that one out of play. It's an unearned run, but I'm sure he's pretty frustrated out there on the mound. And now it's Yvonne Herrera. Here's a 1-1. Rudder takes off. Next pitch has popped up. And that is that. So digging in, Luis Toribio. He struck out swinging at his first at bat. One down, base is empty. And that one hammered. That's back. Pulls it in on the warning track. Man, I love that route. The ball was smoked. He knew he had to get back to the track right away. One down. Stepping in for San Diego, Emmanuel Paquez. He's 0 for 1. This one lifted in the air, left field. Makes the catch for the out. This is important if he can go 1, 2, 3 here. Rocky Bouchang, the next giant to hit. The 1-1. One, one. Line drive, base hit. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. All over that one right there. That's about as textbook as it gets. Got his stride and load out of the way early. He stayed inside that ball and squared it up out front. Man, that was like he was in the cage hitting off a tee. 1-1 one, one now. In the air, pretty deep out to center field. Paquez puts it away. And there are two down. Digging in is the switch inning outfielder, Emmanuel Paquez. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at all. Paquez goes 5 feet, 11 inches, 190 pounds, and he was born in the Dominican Republic. That misses, and a count even 1-1. One and one. Where do you even begin with the talent we've seen from the Dominican Republic? Vladi, Big Poppy, Pedro, the list goes on and on. Two balls, one strike. Not okay. close with that one, and that's ball three. Into the outfield, base hit. And that keeps the inning going. Well, the last 10 games or so have been anything but fun at the plate for him, so that one has to feel good. Pretty tough for the infielders to do anything with that one. He pulled it hard into the outfield, and even when you keep it on the ground, it feels great when you hit a missile like that. The 2 runner on the goal. Ball misses. And safe. It's a stolen base. 
Well, he picked over once just before the pitch to check on him, but that didn't seem to slow up his jump on the pitch at all. I think that guy's been studying some video. Awesome job to be prepared, got the timing down, and he gets into scoring position. Rudder goes again. He goes down looking. Padres leave one, still tied, three and three. So up next, Emmanuel Jaquez, one for three. First pitch swinging. He can live up in the zone all game if guys will chase it. That's just too much velocity. Hitters got to look down in the zone. Next pitch misses inside. And one, one and one. one And there's a ball. That's a base hit. Run scores. Well done. Drives in the run. Pitch was on the outside. Didn't go the other way with it, but still a nice job of using the big part of the field to find a hole. No way he hits it that well if he hooks around the baseball there. Sauer checks over to first, and he's back. Another throw over, and they're keeping him close. Back to first, and again he's back safely. Here's the pitch. Runner goes. Swing and a high fly ball to left. And that's the third out. So five runs in the inning as they batter. And now the first baseman, Luis Toribio. Now batter, the first baseman, Luis. Center field. Jaquez should have this one. Drops into the glove. Runner tags up for third. The throw in. He makes it to third. Good base running to move up with only one out. Here's the center fielder, Cameron Eden. Cameron Eden. The one two. That's towards center. Jaquez flying after this one. Dives, but it falls. And now it looks like extra bases. Runner holds it third, so just one across on the play. Comes through with the RBI. These days, most outfielders play pretty deep, and I'm not sure if that was a factor there or not, but off the bat, you're thinking it's going to be a pop-out, and it just kind of nestled into that spot where no one was able to get to it. Say these guys really needed to win this game today it pushed them over the top to win the series which is great but when you go on the road going into some hostile territory you want to have a lot of confidence and you want to be feeling really good about how you're playing as well as to your left and your right your teammates that they're on track as well and our final here today 8-4 for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB the show I'm John Shambi.